Hi guys, what's going on? It's the Digital Tutor here with another step-by-step -step tutorial. And in today's video, I'm just going to show you an updated method of a couple of things I've been trying to help reset what YouTube recommends to you, uh, YouTube's recommended videos. Uh, if you find this helpful, please leave a like and drop a comment below. And if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more step-by-step -step tutorials, how-tos and tips and tricks for everything tech and digital related. So I did do a previous video and that's a very effective method. If you want to check that out, then click the link at the top now and that will take you to that video. But I've been doing some sort of digging around and I found a couple of other things you can try which are going to help to reset the recommendations and change what YouTube recommends to you. So this is what you can do. So if you actually open up a internet browser and then come across to youtube.com, how it works, basically YouTube recommends videos to you based on what you've watched previously um, and what you've searched. To actually get these changed and reset and you know get different videos recommended what you can do is check out as i say the other video i did do um, and what you can do is a bit more fine tweaking so when you actually come across to your youtube home page all these videos here are being suggested to me based on what i've previously watched now if i wanted to get rid of some of these so say um I didn't want to see any videos on Kung Fu. What I can do is actually come down to this video that's being recommended, click the three dots next to it, and then what I'm going to do is click not interested. If I don't want that channel to be shown to me at all, I can also click don't recommend channel. But what I'm going to do is just click not interested. And this is the important bit. So what you want to do from here is click this one which says tell us why. And then what you want to do is just click I don't like the video. Obviously, if you've clicked I've already watched the video, then what's going to happen is YouTube's going to think, oh, okay, so he likes these kind of videos, but he's already watched that, that one. But that's okay, we can recommend more because he's not said he doesn't like it. Whereas if you go ahead and tick this one, which says I don't like the video, YouTube's going to look at that and think, mm, okay, he doesn't like this video. We're not going to suggest any video similar to that. So we're going to stop doing that um, and that's going to change the algorithm. So all you need to do is just go ahead and click submit. And that's going to feed back to the YouTube algorithm. Um, another thing you can do is when you're scrolling down, sometimes it's going to recommend like uh, certain channels and topics. So, for example, this one here, which says breaking news. I, I don't really like the news. I don't really watch the news. So what I can do is actually click the cross here, which says not interested. And you can see it's actually come up with a message here, which says got it. We'll tune your recommendations, which is great because what they're going to do now, again, that's going to be fed back to the algorithm for YouTube. And they're actually going to tune what they recommend to me. In other words, they're not going to recommend any sort of like breaking news videos or anything along those lines. Um, so yeah, that's, that's how you do it basically. That's a couple more tips. You can either, like I say, do it this way with, with certain videos, just go through. And if you've got a lot of martial arts, I'm, I'm into my martial arts and Kung Fu and, you know, boxing and stuff. But if that's not for you, then you would just click all these videos, which are showing fights and Kung Fu and stuff and just click not interested. And if they're purely like channels, uh, related to fighting you can even go down to don't recommend channel and this is going to fine tune your recommendations um so that's one one way there's a couple of methods in this video as i say do check out my other video that i made as well which goes more into how to delete your watching history and your watching activity to help reset your recommendations as well but if you did find that helpful then please leave a like and drop a comment below i hope that did help uh, also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you do want to help support the Digital Tutor channel, there is a link in the video description down below. And if you go ahead and give that a click, you'll be able to buy the team here a cup of coffee. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.